Welcome back. This is Sandy with Sandy's Organized Chaos and SOC Glitters. And we're still working on lots and lots of orders. So welcome back. So happy to have you join me today. <laughs> I have a lot I have to do. So we're gonna get to work. The kids are at school. Um, I vacuumed already. I still need to do laundry, but I figure I come in here and get some stuff done, then do laundry, then get some more stuff done then lay the baby down for a nap and then get some more stuff done because that, that's what we do. <laughs> All right, so let's get to this. Okay, so I have a lot of um, water slides I have to print today. This is my water slide paper. I know I had a question. I always get questions on what water slide paper I use. This is what I use. I get off Amazon. I'll put it in the description below, but I'm gonna get all my stuff printed out and I'm gonna take it outside, give it my, my clear coat and be able to apply it to our tumblers. So somebody had asked on my last little midweek vlog, because if you ask your questions down below, I'll answer it in my next midweek vlog. I did answer her, but I wanted to answer it here as well. She asked if I'd make any ready to sell tumblers for Christmas or if I just do orders. Now, right now, all I do is just orders. Once an order comes in, I, I make it then because I don't really have the time to make ready to ship items and I have a lot of different designs as well. So I don't make any uh, ready to ship items. I'd love to, but I just can't right now at least. Okay, we're outside having lunch. Had to take a break, let the animals out let the baby out to play. Then I gotta go in and lay the baby down for a nap and pick up where I left off. <laughs> Never ending. <laughs> but back when I first started, I did do ready to ship items. And that first Christmas, I stayed open well until almost uh, Christmas day. I was shipping ready to ship items and they were arriving Christmas Eve for customers. And I think that's really what set me apart from a lot of people when I first started. So I highly recommend if you're new, make those ready to ship items and stay open well into December. When everybody else shuts down, those customers will come to you. Somebody also asked if we sell uh, our turners and we don't, we, we just don't do that right now. But there are lots of other places out there that do uh, sell turners that you you can look into so that's another option for you if you, you just can't make one for yourself and as you can see here I kind of I'm just kind of throwing this in here my plaid coaster <laughs> I'm basically using the same exact stuff that I used on my plaid tumbler and I'm gonna make up this coaster real quick because I don't I didn't want to make a whole tutorial just on the coaster itself because it's so extremely easy you're pretty much gonna do exactly like we did on the tumbler, but on the inside of the coaster here. I just use washi tape instead of electrical tape because it was a little bit smaller. I'm gonna line it up just like I did uh, with the tumbler there. <clears throat> Sorry, excuse me. <laughs> I'm gonna line up the tape just like I did with the tumbler, paint my black on, and then rotate that and make the other stripes for the other way, paint my green on, do my, do my metallic stripes, you know, if you want to for the other plaid portion of it, and there's your coaster. So I thought I'd throw that in just for you guys to see, you know, just, just a little filler, I guess. <laughs> but when I had time the other day, I went ahead and put this together and I didn't want the, the footage to go to waste. So there you guys go. <laughs> okay, back to questions. <laughs> Somebody else on my last midweek vlog asked um, how I get my uh, photo for um, the tumblers that I sell. I did that photo myself. Um, when, I, when I prepped all my, my tumblers, I just lined them up and made a nice little photo with them. And I just edited it in an app, like a photo collage app and added all the little writing and stuff in it that way. So it's very simple to do. And then you can use it for all your, uh, in your descriptions for wherever you sell. So that way customers can see what kind of uh, tumblers that you sell. Well, the styles and sizes, you guys, you guys know what I mean. <laughs> OK, 
case somebody else had asked, they had purchased a tumbler that was already painted. I guess it was pink, I guess. And they were, they were just wondering if they could go ahead and apply decals to that and put epoxy over that. And there is nothing wrong with that, guys. I, I do it all the time with my kids' uh, water bottles and stuff. I'll, I'll buy them already pre-painted and then I'll put their names on it and then I'll epoxy it real good. And I haven't had any issues with that so that is perfectly fine to do that obviously the only thing you want to make sure you do before you apply your decals is wash it up real good with soapy water spray it down with some alcohol just to get any um oils off of it from the factory so that's that's the only thing you really want to make sure you do before you do that now I get this question a lot as well. Some I, I always have somebody ask me how I make my videos, how I edit my videos and, and all that stuff. I, <laughs> I mean, I try to relay what I do. I just use my, my iPhone, that's pretty much all I do. And I just have a little stand and every time I know I wanna record something, I'll, I'll turn on my, my phone and, and record it. And then um, the iPhones are equipped with iMovie, which where you can edit your, your movies and, and stuff like that. And that's pretty much what I do when I make these videos. It's kind of hard to explain. I, I don't know. I've really been into photography for a long time. Just like learned it myself. So doing photos and videos have just kind of been something, maybe like a hobby outside of a hobby, like a hobby and a hobby, I, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> Something like that, but that's pretty much all I do to edit my videos. It's very simple Okay, that was it for all the questions on my last little midweek vlog. So thank you guys so much for asking the questions Thank you so much for watching. I want to thank everybody so much for all the positivity uh, That you guys are constantly giving me and I I'm just beyond humbled I'm beyond thankful to have you guys here and, and share this with you. So thank you so much. And again, ask those questions and I'll make sure to ask it next midweek vlog. So, okay, here we go. Now my coaster's all done. All that talking and, and it's done. Now I'm just gonna hit my coaster up with my torch and there you go. See how easy that plaid coaster was? I know you guys got this, but like I said, this was just a little um, thing I did the other day and I didn't want the video to go to waste. So I hope you guys enjoyed that little bit of a break from me working. All right. I know everything was all sped up, but that actually took a really long time. I've been going at it since really early this morning, but I pulled more orders to get started on for a personalization. Made a pretty good dent in my board, but I have to fill it back up. So I'm going to come back through and start. This is the stuff that needs to go out the soonest. That's the stuff that kind of, I just keep rotating here. So I'm just going to start off here and fill back in some more orders that have come in and I got to pull those. So that's how I'm going to spend the rest of my day. I'm going to get those going. Um, I go pick up the kids, dinner, you know, all, all that stuff. <laughs> but I'm going to go ahead and let you guys go. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss more tips, vlogs, tutorials. I, I got tutorials coming. Don't worry, guys. <laughs> I'm working on it. But don't forget to hit, uh, check out the description box for more people that I'm posting in there, more shops. So you can go show love, purchase things, whatever, whatever you got to do. Let's show love to one another because that's what we need, right? So so make sure you hit that that description box down there and check out some more shops that I posted in there today. All right, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.